All right, I'm going to do sort of a preview, but also an overview of a mod that I've got coming up. It's going to be coming out. It's a buildable bridge. Um, currently, it is just a two lane. Um, <laughs> here I am standing in the middle of the road. Uh, two lane uh, concrete box girder bridge um, with piers and abutment. Um, it will be able to be expanded. I may have a three, four lane uh, come out with it as well. Or it might be an update later down the road. I don't know. Um, but when it comes out, you'll have a two mods, right? Um, you'll have a buildable bridge concrete piers, and you'll have the buildable bridge concrete girder bridge, or the buildable concrete box girder. Those are the two zip files that you currently have. Eventually, I'll probably do a metal bridge girder, maybe concrete girders. I mean, this is going to be able to expand to all different types of bridges and stuff like that. Um, when you go in, you'll go to your tools, and there will be a buildable bridge section. So, um, the concrete girders will be here, too. I was just updating their icons, so I'll show you where they're at right now. But they will be in this section as well. So you get your concrete pier. You'll be able to change the color of the bridge material. We'll do a darker shackles. What this is is... <laughs> It's also the color of the um, concrete former material. Um, you get your actual shackles. I just got to change the color of that for when you're lifting it. And you can buy that. You also have a concrete abutment. Um, this is what will basically sort of start the bridge. Uh, you got your transport and your stationary. So you'll have an actual ramp going up to the, to the bridge part. Um, we'll do a color there, just like shackle color for lifting and stuff like that. Um, stationary, you will need a mobile shop to do this. Stationary makes it increase the mass up to, yeah, 10,000 tons. Um, otherwise, it's 15.3. So you can lift it by the crane, place it in position, and then you'll need a mobile shop to do that. Um, so I'll have it just like this. The um, yeah, <laughs> I guess I need to update the dimensions of that. Okay. Uh, currently, so so the box girder sections will be in here as well, just because I was updating them. They're in here. Um, so you've got a single straight section. Then you've got, um, so this is uh, a full 36 meter um, set of straight. So you can change the color. I know it does this in the store. When you actually buy it, it won't. And it, it'll do this in the store, but not when you actually purchase it. Um, you've got a 36 meter span with 14 meter radius curve, 15 meter radius, 20, 30, 33, 45, 50, 60, 80, 90, 155 meters, uh, 230 meters, and 360 meter curve. The last thing you've got is this um, box beam single span. And what this is for is you'll use these to transport and get them to site um, and build your initial section. And then once you've assembled it, get rid of them all and buy the single span. The single span is designed so that you have less components, uh, individual components to, to in your game. And so you'll, you can use this to lift into place and you have all the different radius curve sections all the way down to a 14 radius curve um, for that. All right. So this is a, just a high level. Uh, well, let me I'll get one of the, I think this one. I'll get this one to show you some of the features of all the um, individual sections. All right. I didn't buy it.
<laughs> Let me go by it. I just changed all the colors and didn't do anything. Okay. So here we have uh, the pier. It is currently set up. I'm going to get squished. Love it. Um, it is currently set up to have just the uh, concrete former sections. You'll notice you get a lot of uh, IC nodes. This is to adjust the angle. This is to adjust the angle of this half. So from here up, you've got another set that are going in the ground right now, which you can't see. And that's to adjust the angle of the other half. Then you have these across here, which adjust the angle going across. So angling it like this or angling it like that, um, that we can get what's called super elevation. Um, when you're lifting it with the crane, you'll be able to adjust the height. Um, so it goes up to, I think, 50, 55 meters high. Um, and then when, once you get it there, and I'll do an individual one with this. So that's most of the features of this. Here, you've got a lot of the same um, nodes. I think these these nodes are for a ghost pier. What a ghost pier will do is it will show you where the next one is supposed to go. So you come all the way out here, and this is where the next pier is supposed to go. And it's, since this is level, it's going to be level. Um, but you can, sh you can, so here you can see that's 14 meter radius that way. And so that's pretty much where you would need to put the pier for 14 meter radius that way. Um, the pier also has a ghost capability. It's down at the base. So you can see them here. So I'll turn it on, show the next pier. That's actually going down into the ground. Um, but this is on both sides, so you can do it on either side. Uh, you've got, on this side, you've got the angle of the pier. So the percent slope, you go from zero all the way up to 50% slope. The slope on this is exactly the same. It's those, you go from zero to, four, zero to 15 percent slope up, zero to 50 percent slope down on both sides that way you can do that uh, with the each box girder section you have um, these little IC nodes and these are to add specific um, color lines right so you can basically customize your lines for all sorts of stuff. Um, here you've got uh, K rail on the side, um, the big this one has all the same stuff right in the middle as well, except this is more spaced out. Um, you've got yellow, yellow, Double yellow, white on both sides. So this would be for your, if you want to do your yellow, yellow. Uh, or you can also do one side, one side yellow, one side white. You also have your K rail. Right now, only right in the middle, the K rail will have a collision. Um, I got to see how many collisions it will allow me to have, but as you can see, I can walk all the way across it, so you can have a vehicle go all the way across it as well. Um, this does weigh over 400, almost 500,000 uh, kilograms, uh, so you will need a big crane to lift it. Um, all right, so that's. Eh, I'll put these lines on. Eh. 
actually, no, it'd be yellow. Sorry, it'd be white. Because it's a white, white, yellow. Perfect. There we go. Um, yeah. So the next video, I will show how to build a bridge. Yeah. All right. Bye.